first thing here, when you're traveling, just go to 7 Eleven and get their, their spicy uh, cayenne and peppers stick. By far the best. The, the chicken cayenne stick. Chicken. That's what it's called. And Chris just goes with this. McDonald's. You can't beat McDonald's try and find it. What are these things? Some big pots. Want to go in? We didn't know what to do today, so we came to Roskilde. It's just somewhere not in Copenhagen. Yeah, there's a Viking museum here. It's kind of kind of cold though. Kind of cold as it under. Look at that, Look at that tree, man. They knobbed it at the top. Oh. Enjoy my That's a headstone made to look like a tree. Interestingly enough, it doesn't give any information as the year. Hans Peterson. Oh, it's a family one. Okay. But, just for right there? Huh. Is there a lot of clocks? You go that way? It's yeah. got the interesting building over there. How are doing? There's a lot of people down the street. Then let's go find out why. Oh, there's another sign. Found the Viking Museum. Nice. Look at all these things that I don't have. I saw a documentary on the Vikings 13 years ago, and this place was featured in it. And now I'm finally here. I didn't think the day would ever come that I'd ever actually see this place. So happy. And these things are from 750 AD. That's old. And they're somehow still here. Well, I mean, obviously not in, obviously not intact, but still here. The way we prefer to explore towns is by just walking around aimlessly until we find cool things. It's cheap. It's fun. We see weird things. We found a church thing whose ruins are underneath the square. Ow. Small grave. Those are some toofs. This is where the prisoners are kept. Reminds me of Christmas.
You can see it moving. This door is very, very cool. I think they made it just to make a cool looking door. And this way it looks pretty cool. Hanging bird. How fancy. So for anybody that cares, there's these in the floor. And what these represent, well, I mean, they don't represent it. I mean, they're actually the graves of people. So this is a knight, I think.